Being one of the wealthiest icons in hip hop, it's no surprise Dr. Dre owns over $80 million worth of LA real estate. Amidst his divorce, he's been selling some of his homes, including his Woodland Hills mansion, but he still has three luxe pads to choose from. Dr. Dre owns a Calabasas crib, a Swamp Pacific Palisades, and of course, his humongous palace in Brentwood. We're gonna check these homes out, and we even found the listing. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Dr. Dre is a rapper, record producer, businessman, and more who's one of the richest figures in hip hop, having amassed an estimated net worth of $820 million or more. While Dr. Dre may have offloaded his Woodland Hills home, he has three other California estates to stay at, one of which being his home in Calabasas, where it's thought he's shacking up currently. Hey guys, it's Care the Vampire Slayer back with another exclusive house tour here on Famous Entertainment, this one checking out Dr. Dre's mansion. Be sure to subscribe and ring that bell for notifications because we post brand new videos daily. As always, you can follow me over on Instagram to chat, and now let's get into this video. In 2018, Dr. Dre dropped $4.9 million on a sprawling home in the lavish neighborhood of Calabasas, California. But we can assume he's updated the home since moving in. He purchased the place. Listing photos show the interiors were slightly basic and underwhelming. That being said, the home had a lot of potential and boasts plenty of space, about 9,300 square feet with six bedrooms and seven baths throughout. The home is nestled in the exclusive Mountain View Estates community, a quiet street, and overlooks views of the rolling hills. Privacy was definitely one of the selling points for this property, and it's well isolated from other neighbors too. The grounds are lushly landscaped with grassy lawns, mature trees, and add-ons like a limestone fountain. Home was built in 1997, and at the time of Dr. Dre's purchase, it custom details like stone floors, iron and glass front doors, and more. It's certainly a classic McMansion from that era with a cream-colored exterior and terracotta roof, not to mention some white columns out front. Dr. Dre his garage has room for up to eight vehicles, and it's an ideal spot to store his fancy cars like Bentleys and Rolls Royces. Stepping inside Dr. Dre's Calabasas mansion, and it's easy to see the foyer was designed to impress. There's a cascading staircase with soaring double height ceilings and a chandelier, while the entry opens into a formal dining room. The high ceilings continue into this space. There are also big windows to look out onto the ground. Also on the main floor, there's a top of the line kitchen with massive stainless steel refrigerators, an Eden Island, and its own casual breakfast nook. Most of the main living spaces have vaulted ceilings, while the family room has a fireplace, entertainment wall with surround sound, and more. While the home is certain stunning at the time of purchase, the interior design was a bit too late 90s in style, so let's hope Dr. Dre modernized things a little bit since. Elsewhere, there was a unique home theater designed by Theo Kalmarakis, a specially engineered recording studio, as well as a games room. It's no doubt that the quirky theater and games room would be fun for kids, but there are also some other grown-up friendly amenities at Dre's home. There's a full mirror gym for when you're feeling motivated, and when you'd rather relax, you can retreat to the master suite, which boasted an all beige bathroom. Aside from the odd interior touches in many of the rooms, we can assume that Dr. Dre had fitted the Calabasas crib with a more stylish design. The grounds of the property are pretty spectacular as well and offer amazing views of the mountain. There's something for everyone back here from a tennis court to a freeform swimming pool and spa, as well as a barbecue and grilling area. The lot is one of the biggest and most private in the gated community, spanning three quarters of an acre, and it's complete with a fountain, cozy fire pit area, overlooking the views, and surrounded by mature palm trees. Of course, that's not all for Dr. Dre's real estate portfolio. In 2019, the hip-hop icon dropped $2.25 million on a home in the coveted Pacific Palisades community, which is a sleek and modern Mediterranean-style abode. As you may have guessed, it's in a high-end and gated community to provide sought-after privacy as well. The property is situated on a ridge, so much like his Calabasas property, there are stunning panoramic mountain and ocean views from every angle. Originally built Built in 1997, Dre's Palisades abode has underwent a full modern update, bringing in a moody gray color scheme, some wide plank dark oak flooring, as well as contemporary fixtures. Inside, 3,100 square feet of living space are fitted with four bedrooms and four bathrooms over two levels. Walking in, visitors are welcomed through double doors right into a formal living room and matching dining room. 
The open concept layout progresses and opens to a large combined space where there's a sparkling kitchen with quartz topped island. Dre's kitchen here offers custom white cabinets, stainless steel appliances, and a breakfast nook dining area. Not to mention there are views of the hills and oceans from here and doors out to the terrace, making this the heart of the home. The main living spaces all appear to be light and bright and the family room boasts a cozy fireplace as well as space to unwind. Dre's master suite here is made up of a separate sitting room with its own fireplace as well as a private balcony with picture perfect view. Not to mention there's a hammock set up here out on the balcony. Master treat is rounded off with a luxury attached bath with jetted spa tub. Out back through glass sliders on the main floor, there are terraces with space to entertain as well as not one but two fire pits. Residents of the gated community also receive a Summit Club membership that allows you to utilize the pool, spa, sports court, gym, tennis courts, playground, private park, and much more. All of this is only steps away from Palisade Village as well as the beach. Before we end this house tour, we can't forget Dr. Dre's mega palace which has served as his main estate for years. This massive home was custom built from the ground up and designed by architect Richard Landry, costing an estimated $20 million to construct aside from the cost of the land. Dre paid $40 million for the home and it's located in the Brentwood area of Los Angeles, a peaceful and posh neighborhood on the west side. The mansion was built to resemble a French country chateau, offering features like cobblestone pathways outside and architecture to give it a bit of a European vibe. The exterior is clad in limestone with reclaimed beam ceilings inside, salvaged tile and antique door. Inside it spans 18,000 square feet of space, not including his more recent extension to the place, and there are 8 beds and 9 baths throughout. Rooms are spread out among 2 full wings, and upon walk in there is a double height entryway with stunning marble flooring, as well as a giant chandelier. This marble theme continues through to the spacious chef's kitchen. Nearby spaces include a center hall, great room, dining room, family room, and seven fireplaces. Not to mention the whole house has super high ceilings and a lot of natural light flooding in. Some other features inside Dre's mansion include a wine cellar, library, media room, fully equipped gym, sauna, covered terraces, and six car garage. Each room has been furnished and decorated to perfection, boasting intricate details and more. While the mogul's master suite has a custom chandelier, huge walk-in closet, balcony, and more. Out on the grounds, there's a koi pond, waterfall, and even a moat complete with a bridge, which makes the home feel something like a cat. Out back, you'll find the massive infinity pool and spa with full pool deck and cabana, which is a staple for any property like this. Palace also claims to be eco-friendly, with grounds irrigated by a gray water system, while electricity is supplied via solar panel. The home also has environmentally friendly heating and cooling system. In 2017, Dr. Dre gave a tour of this home. It was clear the mansion was undergoing a huge renovation. Apparently, he added a 10,000 square foot recording studio and music facility underneath the home too. All right, so that's all I got on Dr. Dre's homes. And as you can see, he has some pretty luxurious real estate. While he may be offloading some of his properties due to his divorce, he clearly has a few to choose from. So it's been said he's shacking up at his Calabasas crib at the moment, but if it were you, which of the three homes would you stay at? The Brentwood Mansion may be a little bit too big if we're being honest, but I love the style of that home the best, especially the French Chateau aesthetic. Anyways, be sure to let me know your fave Dr. Dre home down in the comments. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram to chat, and I will see you all next time. Bye!